And it's windy today, so I'm not even sure you guys can hear me, but today we're taking delivery of another car that we got from the auction site for a friend of mine. And actually, a couple of friends of mine have uh, gotten cars through the auction site. I'll put a link to that video in the description. So here we go. Hey everyone, welcome to the channel. Obviously the wind was really nasty, so I want to do a voiceover on this. So my friend basically, and I'll show you exactly the steps he went through. He went to one of my contacts and emailed them. They suggested that he go on Gunet English, which is obviously where you can buy. It's kind of like the auto trader of Japan. And so he didn't want to go the auction route because he wanted it faster. So he didn't want to wait. And he actually emailed uh, my contact and I'll put all of the video um, links and description of the contacts or emails in my video description. So he found one online that he liked. He had the negotiators negotiate for him a really great price. And within two weeks, boom, that truck is arriving here in Okinawa. And what it is, it's a Land Cruiser Prado or Prado. Not sure how they pronounce it here. And it's beautiful. Look at that thing. It's all jacked up. It's really nice looking. You can do this too. Now, remember King's Auto, they're not sponsoring me. I just think they're really great people. They uh, can ship it to the United States if it's 25 years or older, or they can ship it here to Okinawa. He's really happy with the truck. The truck is pretty amazing. I will do a full in-depth review on his vehicle. He did not pay crazy, crazy prices. He got a really good deal. So the truck is here. It just got here. He ordered it again uh, through one of my contacts over at uh, the auction house in Japan. He actually got it from the dealer. Because they do that as well. And it looks pretty cool. So they're gonna drop it off here. We're gonna take a look at it more in depth. It's super windy, which kind of sucks, but at least it's a nice day out. And as you can see, it's a pretty good looking truck, a four door, four wheel drive. It's got the big tires on it. I'm not a four wheeler, so I don't know all the terminology, but it looks pretty, uh, pretty jacked up. So let me explain the steps that he took in order to be able to purchase his vehicle. Basically, he went on Gunet, and here we see Gunet. And you can search, they have an English site and a Japanese site. Now the Japanese site will probably have, I find them to have more listings, but the English site is so easy to navigate. So he found his Land Cruiser. Let's just find a Land Cruiser here. And then he got the number and he emailed my friend at King's Auto and they started the negotiations. And it went back and forth and he actually requested more pictures. He requested a video. He requested a couple of things uh, from them and they were more than happy to oblige and they actually sent it to him very quickly. The paperwork was sent, but since he lives, <laughs> since he lives on base, uh, they couldn't deliver it on base. So I said, just deliver it to my house because I live off base. And as you can see here, the delivery driver flatbeds it right to your home. Now, if you're in Okinawa, the process is really simple after this. You basically just take the bill of sale form and bring it to base and get your plates and everything and pass JCI and boom, you've got a, a vehicle that most people want and think it's really tough to get. It's not, it's very easy to get. So this is a quick video, everybody. This video was obviously made before we went down on certain restrictions and before the social distancing happened, uh, but I had the B-roll and the footage and I wanted to let you guys know that it still is very easy if you wanna buy a car from Japan, whether for import into United States or for import into Okinawa and you're a service member and you want a, a car that's a little more unique, a little more than what you'll find on island. We do live on a small island, so the selection is very limited. So go ahead and give my boys a call. They are fantastic, boys and girls, I should say, because uh, the woman that helped me was, was really sweet and she's amazing. Um, they will take care of you. And they're very upfront, they all speak English, they do WhatsApp, they do uh, chat, and they also do text, and they also do email. So if you're looking for a really great value, something that you can't find on island, or if in, you're in the United States and you're thinking, wow, I would really love a JDM car, give these guys a call. It's so much easier and don't be scammed by people that want to charge you for access to auction sites or people that want to charge you because they say they're professional fixers i think what i got charged for my van was a 250 dollars flat fee for processing and paperwork and i think he got charged i think 300 dollars. i think because his was a little more um uh the negotiations were a little more in depth than mine was and i bought mine from the auction where he bought his from a dealer all going through the same people at king's auto who are pretty awesome Carpet even smells it. Whoa, you got rear rear heat yeah. rear heat controls. Yeah. Nice. Sure it's a really nice truck, man. I like it.
Very cool. Let's open it up back here. I don't know if this opens up. Uh, I'm gonna put some oil on that, but a lot of room back here. It's got an amplifier. You think it'll start back up? Probably gonna have to hit up. You're gonna hit up these hinges with oil or something. And I will see you next video. Everyone, please stay safe out there.